As you can see, it records your entire, entire screen. Did you guys remember a minute ago I said, stop, go to the file settings and start around messing with 2000? Now, what you want to do then, My name is Alex and welcome back to a brand new video and I know it is Wednesday so that means usually a Sony Vegas tutorial but in this video guys I'm gonna just upload another video that's the most requested video out of everything. Now people always ask because I'm, I'm uploading tutorials about Audacity, about Sony Vegas, how do I record my screen in HD without lag for free, without spending a cent. Well guys I've been using for years I've been using OBS, Open Broadcaster Software. Now I'll see a lot of people complaining that they have have huge files when they record with fraps and like how to get rid of the watermark guys stop you using fraps because it makes huge files and it's almost impossible to edit without a lag just use OBS it is completely for free you don't need to spend anything there's no license there's no watermark at all so I'm gonna show you guys in this video how to use it now just set it up so as you can see what you want to do is you want to go to the first link in the description that will bring you to this page obsproject.com forward slash download and we're gonna download OBS and we're gonna get it started and how to get the best settings without any lags so right now, right here on the page, you want to choose what kind of oper operating system that you have. Are you using uh, Apple, uh, iOS, are you using Windows? I'm just going to click on Windows because that is my operating system. We're going to select the Windows icon and we're going to click on Download Installer. Now it's just going to open up this box and I'm just going to click on Bestand Opslam. That's Dutch for Run or Save As. And right now we're going to start running the actual installer. So we're going to go to come to my downloads and I'm going to go over to this one OBS Studio full installer and I'm just going to double click on it. So I'm going to hit the installer. I'm going to hit it off from there. So as you can see, it brings up this box. It says, welcome to the OBS Studio 17.0.2 set of wizard. Click on next. I agree. I'm just going to create a new uh, folder. Obviously, that's a new follower on Twitch. Thank you very much. I'm going to click on next and I'm just going to click uh, on browser plugin, click on install. Now it's installing, and then when it's finished installing, we're just gonna straight open it up. A few moments later. All right, guys, so it's finished installing, and we're gonna click on run OBS and click on finish. Now, as you can see, it is opening up OBS Studio. All right, guys, so as you guys clearly can see, this is our OBS Studio. So what we're going to do first of all is we're going to go to the settings first because if you're just going to go ahead and record your uh, uh your screen straight away without you know applying the settings you can just end up with a very blurry um unconfigured uh screen we're going to go to the file tab and we're going to go to settings and right now we're going to just going to go into the output tab now right here as you can see it says output mode we're gonna keep it on simple and the video bitrate is you want to mess around with this until you find a good spot my bitrate is 5000 so what you want to do is you just want to go ahead and you want to type in 2000 click on apply or click on ok we're gonna to go to the scenes box we're gonna click on right click add and we're gonna just call this uh, our screen obviously then what we're gonna do is we are going to create a new source right click add and we're gonna click Click, and we are going to click on display capture obviously then we're going to click on create new boom and as you can see it is recording my entire display so obviously it's looking really spacey so i'm just going to double click on display and i'm just going to pick my other monitor this one and as you can see this is my standard obs that i'm running uh, this recording with so as you can see this is my obs this is how to record your screen anything you do on the screen will be seen so if i open up audacity for instance that i'm showing my recording as you can see it records your entire entire screen did you guys remember a minute ago i said start, go to the file settings and we'll start around messing with 2000 now what you want to do then what you want to do then is put this one to 2000 and right here you can choose uh the uh the the location where you want to save it so you can go to uh videos you can go to uh to your desktop and record it right there uh, then you want to pick recording format is going to be mp4 obviously and you want to just click on high quality medium file size so now what we're going to do is we're going to put this to 2000 click on apply click on ok now you want to just go ahead and start recording and then you want to stop recording and check if the quality is good if it's not go back to the settings and just hire this with 500 each time is 2000 not working for you no problem just type in 2500 click on apply click on ok click on start recording for me i start 
started experimenting and I ended up with 5000 being the best quality for me. It depends on from PC to PC, uh, obviously. But right here, you just want to go ahead and mess around with the video bitrate. That's the quality that your video will be recorded in. So you just want to click on apply, click on OK, click on start recording. And now you are good to go, guys. This is how you record your screen with OBS for free. As you guys clearly can see, that has a simple list. So if you guys want to see more OBS tutorials, make sure to check out the playlist. You can find it in the description. I have a bunch of tutorials out there. So that is it. That's how you record your screen for free. Just disregard fraps or any program that makes huge files or programs you need to pay for just use obs studio it works like a charm so that is it for this video thank you guys for the continued support we're almost at 100,000 subscribers we're gonna get the silver play button within this and just a few months guys so thank you guys for the support and i'll catch you guys next time just alex helford